is Ryan Watts. Um, so tell me about a situation at work that showcases your work ethic and your professionalism. For me, that would be my time as a retail sales specialist at Verizon, specifically during Black Friday and Christmas. Um, it's tempting as a sales rep to want to, um, you know, get as many single sales as possible, um, especially when it's so busy and people are just, you know, ready to buy so quickly. Um, but it's important not to forget the proper processes that the company put in place to maximize each opportunity. Um, again, it's tempting for sales reps to want to just kind of hit their numbers for the day, but um, the key in that time of the year is um, efficiency. You have to remember that they're there to spend, they have a budget, you know, they're, they're, they're there for tech related, um, you know, tech related gifts and they probably have the spend available um, being so close to the holidays. Um, you know, they're there to hear promotions, they're here, they're there to kind of, you know, hear what you got um, and they're kind of expecting to be presented with, you know, additional information. Um, so the key is efficiency, because you you do want to get as many customers as possible, but you got to maximize each sale, um, especially when it's so busy. Um, another more marketing related um, example of this would be during an onboarding phase that I had more recently. <clears throat> Excuse me, and um, you know I kind of want to just go through the onboarding phase quickly, making an old hat. Um, get used to everything more quickly and not have to, again, go through that learning phase. So I worked a little bit extra on the weekends. Um, so question two, tell me about a time where you did not meet the expectations for a client or a superior and what you did about that. Um, so on the marketing side of things, I wasn't monitoring conversions for a campaign and um, we noticed a decrease or a downwards trend rather in conversion actions. And it was, you know, first thing, you've got to be accountable. Um, second thing, you've got to figure out what's going on there. Um, it was it was definitely my fault. I was monitoring CPC and top level metrics. I wasn't digging into things. Um, so first action item I did to correct this um, was I built out a detailed benchmarking and analysis, da analysis dashboard um, to monitor and determine exactly uh, where that trend was coming from, looking into the details, what we could do to fix it. Um, and then from there, the solution was implementing audience testing to overcome that hurdle, to overcome that obstacle. Um, the audiences that we were using might have gotten a little stagnant. stagnant. Um, so again, we implemented, implemented audience testing, um, segmented by ad sets to figure out and determine exactly, exactly what was going on there. Um, then lastly, um, yeah, lastly, question three, if this season of your life had a mission, what would it be and what would what steps would you take to accomplish it? Um, so first I wanted to say that I couldn't believe this question was on the questionnaire because in the, it, it's a little personal, but in the last few months, um, you know, I've, I've, I've had a very introspective, um, I've had a, a few very introspective moments where I realized who I am, what I value, what I want out of life. Um, so I kind of made it my mission to be happier, to be more confident, to respect myself more. Um, I'm kind of funny like on the inside, so I'm trying to bring that out more. Um, so the proper, or, um, excuse me, the um, steps that I put in place to, um, to make that a reality were that I put myself into more social situations, trying to provide value to more to more social situations instead of nodding along and trying to, you know, just get through to the end of the conversation. Um, and yeah, just trying to be more outgoing, uh, respect myself more, um, you know, walk confidently, exercise more. That's really important. And uh, yeah, I just kind of wanted to wrap things up and say, <laughs> I really couldn't believe that was a question because um, this has been a few of the most incredible months of my life.